Okay, so here's DMedia, right? Now for the rest of the screencast, I'm not going to touch the computer that I'm making the screencast from. Um, you know, this one, so no more touching it. I'm going over to my little netbook that I've already peered. Um, so these are both, both associated with the same user account. And I have DMedia open on this netbook. And I'm gonna create a project called letter A. Look at that. I'll stop the importer on this. I'll create another project. I'll call it B. Look at that. Stop the importer. I'll create another project. I'll call it C. Stop the importer. And now I've decided that I actually wanted to import into project B. So I'm clicking on it. The importer started. And again, this is all from the netbook, not the computer I'm doing the screencast from. And I'm inserting a card into the card reader. Media sees the card, it's starting to import. And look at that. Look at that. So, as the media is importing on another device, um, the changes to the, the project document are getting streamed um, as it updates. So, you're in the screencast watching the import happen from computer it's not happening on. Um, so one of the things coming in Notebook at 12.10 is we now have the this project picking, picking screen on DMedia um, now responds to the catch to be changes feed. Um, most of the Nova Cut UI has for quite a while but in DMedia it hasn't. So this is a, a cool new thing and um, it's also nice because it's something that you know it's one of your first experiences with, with DMedia after you've peered it and this stuff all works with the you know, real-time sync. So, and it will just keep on updating as my little netbook um, painfully chugs through hashing all these files. But uh, yeah, so this is coming to uh, the media Novacut 12.10, which is um, being released this Thursday, uh, whatever, 26th, I think. So, all right, thanks for watching. Now I'm touching this computer again. I guess I lied a little bit.